Hello everyone. Hello everyone. Hello everyone. Hello everyone. Hold on. Pause. I think there is something we need to cover before this video starts. That maybe it's something for a completely different video, but hey, I'm still learning and I'm enjoying the process. And oh boy, this wall looks flat. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, Rosa from the future here. I was editing this video and I thought you might need some background information which is not really background it's more like future information anyway since I recorded this video I started to pay attention to the smallest sign because I cannot <laughs> read any sign like I'm so blind like literally and metaphorically those signs were loud even someone like me could not help but notice them. I took notes of every sign I was coming across just because, yeah, I thought oh, this, is can, this can be possible, right? I had this video, the making of this video in my mind even after because I didn't edit it right after recording it. So I thought once I would finally edit the video, I could look back and say, damn, I was blind. So anyway, I hope this makes sense grammatically. Maybe it doesn't, I'm sorry. Anyway, the signs were loud. <clears throat> this is how I call the note. Ooh. Clear signs from the universe stopping your scared dumbass and supporting your high achiever powerful higher self manifesting. <laughs> what? <laughs> manifesting your true destiny. Anyway, this note was created in June and I don't remember. That's why I take notes. No? Move abroad. I wanted to move abroad. Covid happened. But on a bright note, like why I felt like I still was supported in my decision. I got a job during Covid and I made enough money to move abroad more comfortably once everything is over. Then burnout. <laughs> That's funny. Burnout, crying every day because of my soul sucking job and making a abrupt decision to move abroad somewhere. Somewhere I could feel comfortable but was not really what I wanted. What happened was, oh, yeah, I had this phase. So what happened was positive news about what I really wanted. Hope became fucking real. Divine timing, whatever perfection. <laughs> this is not just hope. This is literally <coughs> caps lock. Getting everything you want the exact way you are envisioning it, typo included. And then what I have here, should I keep going with YouTube? Heart melting comments from wholesome souls and freaking watch time. Like what the hell? Yeah, because there is one video that went not viral, but someone I think someone added to the playlist to their playlist my study with me video, and it was a snowball effect. Like literally, that video has so many views. I I have no idea. And then I have side note. Damn, I'm powerful, which is still energy I support. I don't know how this can be helpful for you, but I just felt like I could share. These are the smallest things that I paid attention to after I filmed this video you're about to watch. Since then, honestly, it was literally a snowball effect and I'm not sad about it. I'm pretty damn happy that I shifted my mindset that day because everything went way better. Maybe it was all this build up energy that I had I just know that since June 24th, everything went better. But I had my fair share of breakdowns and existential crises. And I mean, I had my ups and downs, lots of downs, intense <laughs> downs. I don't want to recall, honestly. My subconscious mind made such an effort to block everything. Hopefully, you don't mind. I'm sorry. I don't know what I'm doing. This is everything I wanted to share before my pep talk, wake up call, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. I am your sign. Wow. I have not much time left for this 2021, which is wild, scary, and also exciting. So you can make the most out of this. You still have time. I mean, you always have time, but you just need to grasp it. Okay. I am rumbling and I'm starting to basically summarize my video, which is not good for the algorithm and watch time. So keep on watching, please. Thank you. And see you soon. Bye. And I'm here to beat your ass. <clears throat> Hello everyone. This is Rosa and I'm here to beat your ass just to give you some motivation. <clears throat> I will go straight to the point because I was talking to myself in the mirror this morning and I felt the urge to make this video. May I have your attention, please? Yes. 
Now that I have your attention, hopefully, stop waiting for a sign. That's it. The video is done. That's it. I'm serious. I'm being serious right now. Stop waiting for any sign. The sign is you watching countless videos about people telling you to go and do whatever you want to do. And trust me, I've been there. I'm still there. I'm slowly trying to get out of this and get to the action part where actually things I want to do are manifesting. The thing is, you need to trust yourself. You need to understand that you have enough power. You have all the power you need to make the changes you want to make. I, I realized I was just watching so many people talking about this topic and I was spending more time watching people talk about this and how to do it than actually put everything I learned in action and work on myself. And maybe you're at this point too. I felt empowered from the world and motivated and everything, whatever you want. But still, when I thought about it, it seemed to me that I was watching all these motivational videos from people that actually motivate me, but I was still waiting for permission from someone else for me to do the thing I've always want to do. This makes no sense. All the videos I've been watching about just do the thing, don't wait for anything. The sign is that you're watching this video, blah, blah, blah. I was still waiting and holding myself back from building the life I want. And the weirdest thing is that I've got a plan. I mean, you know when you're just done and you just wanna make a change and you're just making plans, make, literally making plans for your future. So I looked at my journal and said, I have a plan and I'm here. I mean, I just have to follow the plan. That's really it, that's it. That, that's it should be easy, right? I mean, the journey isn't easy, but this is literally the path I have to follow. I already planned everything. And I mean, why? Why am I blocking myself from creating the life I've always wanted to lead? What am I waiting for? I just don't understand. And maybe, I don't know, I felt really compelled to do this video because I just thought that maybe there were a lot of people, more people like me, I hope, please. I mean, I'm not alone in this. Why would you do that? If you have been feeling like this, this is your sign. I'm telling you, this is your sign. Go and make it happen. Just. Literally, go and make it happen. If you're not doing things for yourself, then you're just living the life someone else wants you to live. You only start living when you're listening to yourself and you're appreciating all the smallest changes happening within you and around you. Think about it. If you're not living for yourself, then you're settling for someone else's standards. If you feel passionate about doing something and you want to start, you feel the urge to create something and you never end up doing it, stop it. Stop blocking yourself. Don't be scared to do what makes your eyes sparkle and what makes you feel alive. Allow yourself to be happy. You are in charge. You can do this. This is your life. If you've been binging a lot of manifestation video or motivational video, luckily becoming that girl is a trend right now, but watch out, can be toxic, but you know, you know you, okay? You've probably built up a lot of motivation and excitement about life about doing things in general, about making these big changes in your life. If you keep looking for these videos because you are just building up your own motivation and excitement without putting anything into action, because you're waiting for something like a clear sign, newsflash, newsflash, this is not gonna happen. People can come to you and support you and just say, do the thing, I will be here to support you, which is one of the most beautiful things and feeling out there, but if everything has to start from you, you have to make the first step. All the excitement about your dream life, your dream job, working on yourself, on your mindset, leaves everything unfinished if you don't take action. Your mind is so powerful, but it has to be followed by action. Your actions are the expression of what you have in your mind. All the small steps are taking you to the next level, to your brightest future that is only yours. And you need to walk toward this, not just mentally. You need to be already there mentally, but you have to walk physically by taking actions. You owe it to yourself. Just wake up, just wake up because you already are that girl. You just need to realize it. So simply put, your lifetime experience on this planet is too short and valuable for you to settle and have regrets. I really want you to remember you are the only person 
always worth the effort. Let that sink in. Now work your magic and make everything you want to happen. I mean, if you're questioning my mood swings during this video, that sometimes I, look, I my, my tone was a bit upset or angry. I'm very passionate about this topic and just know that this is how I usually talk to myself in the mirror. And if you're not having a mental breakdown, whenever you're, you're talking to yourself in the mirror, wow, good for you. You probably don't need to watch this, but still, thank you. Work your magic, make it happen, you're worth it. This is literally it. Do yourself a favor and just be happy, seriously. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you want to, and I will see you soon. Bye bye. I mean, I didn't really have a plan for this because I just had this sudden revelation. <laughs> I just had this sudden revelation that all I want to do with my life is create, like be creative and help people shine. Is this what I want to do? I think I just want to make art and be happy. I want to make connection. I want. I want to meet people. I want to meet inspiring people. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Is it recording? Oh my god! I'm so glad I didn't. <laughs> I'm so glad I got this on camera. I mean, I cannot make this up. I was just going through my Twitter and I. I went. Ah! I mean. Not to always talk about the universe and manifesting and whatever you want because it might be some woohoo for you, but but I was just on Twitter and I saw this and I'm so happy that my camera got it. I, I didn't press pause. Starting on the practical witch tweeted full moon in Capricorn, June 24th. You will finally know what you want to commit to. What job you want, who you want, where you want. No more uncertainties. Finally, a commitment to a path. Finally feeling certain in your decision. I cannot make this up. Today is 25th and yesterday I thought about making a video. I mean, yesterday was 24th. I... Unbelievable. This is magical. I'm such a big manifester. You should watch out, huh?